Hey everyone, so today I'm going to be doing a video on how to slim down fast and also while still eating that fast food. I love fast food like burgers and everything like that so I still eat that like pretty often, not gonna lie. Um, so therefore I thought I'd kind of share how I'm able to do that while still losing weight and while still being able to stay in shape. It's kind of like a lazy girl's guide to staying healthy and fit and toned so <laughs> okay so tip number one is to drink lots of water um obviously it's so important to stay really hydrated it helps to flush out all the toxins and everything from your body and um yeah tip number two is to avoid many carbs as you can um for me um i tend to stay away from bread as much as i can like rice you know pasta that sort of thing but if i was to go get a burger for example I wouldn't eat the bread, I would just take the bread off and I'd just like eat the inside, like it doesn't, it kind of sounds a bit weird and gross but it really works and it gives you that satisfaction of having it without having those extra carbs and things like that because carbs are a problem because they convert to sugar um, and that leads on to my next tip which is tip number three and that is to avoid as much sugar as you can. Um, so essentially it's low carb, low sugar. Um, because sugar in the end is what creates the fat and that is what we don't want. Um, so contrary to popular belief, um, I have come across my tip number four which is actually eat high fat. <laughs> so um, I would eat full fat so often to make up for the fact that I'm not eating as many carbs and sugar or whatever. Um, so that's just compensating for that. So therefore, um, I would have full fat milk, full fat cream, you know, butter, everything like that. Um, avocado in particular is a really healthy fat, you know, things like that um, to consider. Um, it would pay to do maybe a bit of research on things like that if you want to read more into it. Um, but for me, this form of dieting works so well. Um, and also, um, if you're going and you're ordering a meal, for example, don't order a large, order a small, um, which is my tip number five, which is portion sizing. Um, so don't, don't go for like the biggest one, go for like the smaller ones so you're swinging that satisfaction, but just not on a large scale. <laughs> Um, and then tip number six is low alcohol. Um, alcohol contains lots of sugar and carbs and whatever, like beer for example. Um, so therefore, unfortunately, um, that is something to maybe consider limiting a bit um, to help that area. So the next category is exercise, um, obviously this is not something that a lot of people want to do and I'm kind of the same on that to a certain extent, um, so if you want to just do um, like 10 to 15 minutes of exercise per day which takes no time at all, I often do it like before bed, like it's so weird but that works for me because that's just when I'm just free and have that time to just think okay right I'm gonna do it so um, I'll just do like um, right like lie down and I just touch the back of my ankles and I like to do that like back and forth back and forth and I generally do about a thousand of those <laughs> um, but when you're starting out so work start with maybe a hundred and then just work your way up eventually you'll find that you will build up um, that momentum and that you will find it will get easier over time because that's what I definitely found um, and so that's great for just getting that little bit of tone just here on those abs and then therefore if you're losing weight and you're building a little bit of air muscle underneath and also in your leg then it's all going to work well for you. Tip number seven. Another good option um, is scenic walks. So if you're not into exercise or anything like that then you can turn it into something more fun. So you can turn it into something where you're distracted from the fact that you're actually getting exercise and you're just looking at the beautiful views, maybe you're out with your friends and things like that. So turn it into something where it doesn't feel like it's the exercise that you're ahead and that you have to do it it's more something that you want to do and yeah 
tip number eight. Another good tip is tanning. Um, tanning, I find, I feel like tanning makes you look thinner. Like, I don't know why, but I just feel like it does. Like, for example, like, you know, bodybuilders when they go to competitions and they just get really, really bronzed and tanned up because it just shows that muscle definition and things like that. So that is a good option um, for if you're feeling a little off and you just want that little bit of extra self-confidence and boost and just chuck on a bit of tan and you're ready to go to the beach and you're ready to go out and do whatever. So that's definitely something that I'm a fan of. Tip number nine. Um, another product that I love is um, the new Serity Body Silk. Um, so this is amazing. Like I love applying this all over my body every day. Um, it goes on like an oil, but it dries within a few seconds, so you're not getting left with that oily, greasy feel. And it really helps to reduce the appearance of stretch marks um, and cellulite and things like that, which therefore tan was just kind of covering up the problem. This is going to help treat the problem. So they're a great duo. Also, this will help increase the longevity of your tan, and it's also a great heat protectant. I love chucking it through my hair as well. <laughs> Tip number 10. Overall though, I feel like despite doing a video about how to get slimmer and things like that, it's all about boosting self-confidence and that obviously everyone is beautiful in all their shapes and sizes, so I'm not saying in any way that you have to do any of these things. These are just my opinions, my tips for people that want to fit into that dress or that bikini and this is going to help them do that. So. watching and um, be sure to check out my Instagram because I actually did a poll before I did this video to see the general consensus of who wanted to see this because I'm really keen to do content that you guys are interested in watching so I'm always interested in feedback and things like that so yeah that would mean a lot um, cool see you later bye